Since being shot in the head by the Pakistani Taliban for defending girls' rights who go to school, Malala Yousafzai has taken her children's education campaign worldwide. Here, she visits the Zatari refugee camp in northern Jordan, which hosts about 25,000 Syrian school-aged children. 16-year-old Mazun fled the fighting in her hometown of Daraa one year ago. She gleams as she walks beside her role model. Like Malala, she too believes in the power of education. She's become one of the school ambassadors in the Zatari camp, going from caravan to caravan, tent to tent, to encourage people to send their children to school. Aspiring to be a journalist, Mazun joins her fellow pupils in welcoming Malala to their classroom. Malala was inspired by the enthusiasm and determination she witnessed. They say like we want to get education because we want bright futures and all have a dream. Some wants to become a doctor, some wants to become engineers and some wants to become journalists. So it's very good to see them and to have a conversation with them. But there are still so many girls and so many children who cannot go to school. And I think that the whole community uh, outside, international community uh, should uh, help these children. There are currently three main schools in the camp, which can accommodate a total of 15,000 students. Malala's visit is a boost for getting children into the classroom. Having Malala here is really key to highlight the issues that we have here and the fact that it's urgent and that we need to act now and that we need to offer as many opportunities as we can for children to access formal schools, to access informal education and to get the support, the psychosocial support that they need now before they become adults. Outside the camp, 80 Jordanian schools hold classes for Syrians in the afternoons. That leaves about 25% of the nearly 140,000 Syrian school-aged children across Jordan not in classes. But there will be at least one more school soon. Malala's foundation is already teaming up with Save the Children to build a new school while expanding an existing one for Syrian refugees in Jordan.